On August 3rd, 1991, Wanda Watson failed to show up for her 6 p.m. waitress shift at the Marble Arch Hotel in downtown Vancouver. Instead, she was found lying dead on the main hallway floor of her house. She had apparently surprised two burglars and they stabbed her to death as they made their hasty escape with few stolen items to show for their actions. They also set the house on fire from the basement, which did noticeable damage to the southern portion of the exterior. For the next 30 years, the house would remain vacant with only marginal and superficial repairs conducted. The property remained abandoned, boarded up, and a collective nuisance for random dumping. In 1994, the Vancouver City Council voted to declare the house a nuisance and demolish it. The case to preserve the structure was fought all the way to the British Columbia Supreme Court. Various unsuccessful attempts were haphazardly made to keep it in compliance with minimum city ordinances, including surrounding it with a chain-link fence. An absentee owner's tax for empty houses passed in 2018, providing an incentive to put the property on the market. Housing values were also on the rise. The house would sell in April 2021 for 1.5 million Canadian dollars, slightly above the asking price. The murder of Wanda Watson is still no closer to resolution than the day when she was trapped in the wrong location at an inopportune time. <laughs>